friendship brings a lot of class to a bunch of savages. In what way can all those individuals, or those individualities, how can that, can that be a, a problem for the collective? Or is that, is that never... No, no, I mean, we celebrate differences, man. It's the yeah. best thing, you know. We learn from each other daily, non-stop. Mm -hmm. uh, we learn from places that we visit. We've learned from places that we're moving on uh, in the future, thinking of moving on somewhere, you know. All this stuff, I mean, everything comes together nicely. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it's positive it's more just, than negative, absolutely. Yeah, and, absolutely. and human beings are different, whether you come from a different yeah. place. You could be brother and sisters, I'm sure you're different in some ways so <coughs> that exists but we celebrate the differences we learn from them like any family would and then uh, and then keep growing what, what are the biggest differences between between the, the people who are in the band can you can you explain something about that yes uh, musically but if, for example musically you said uh, all, <laughs> you are from the UK you're bringing perhaps more of a British vibe into what you're maybe, doing maybe yeah yeah I mean differences I mean uh, uh, simply from the kind of background they came from, kind of music I used to listen to, and the kind of music that I would listen to because of the influences mm -hmm. my sister and right. other people have in me. Right. Things like that. I love women, she loves men. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Things like this, yeah. You know? Uh, can you, for you personally, perhaps explain what kind of music you, you listen to that got into uh, Gogo Badala? Um, I would not want to claim it's because of me that got into it, but uh, I've listened to and played a lot of reggae in the past, uh, and 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 Eugene and the rest of the guys I love reggae already. So when I came into the band and those ideas came through, it was easy to come through me because I've lived and understand and played that kind of music. So uh, a lot of people come to me is like, oh, that's your influence, and I don't want to claim that is my influence, but I probably played it nicely. <laughs> <laughs> Very you nice. Know? <laughs> Good job. <laughs> to yourself. Yeah. <laughs> no, for I mean, you. I've done it for a while, so I'm, I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty cool enough to say that I can play reggae. <laughs> <laughs> and how is that for you? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I don't think specifically any music that I listen to has really kind of influenced any change in the band or anything. But I think it's just the energy, you know, is different. <laughs> Um, I mean, just individually, where I'm from, who I am, is in in that mix, you know. Absolutely. So that's that's my that's my contribution, you know, mm -hmm. on top of everything. And I also love the same kind of music that all these guys do too. So when we all get to listen to the music, it's great because it's like, oh my god, this track is amazing, you know. And and and, and I should say something about that because uh, she brings a lot of class to a bunch of savages. <laughs> 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 you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Outside of the music, that yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you need her to, to give you direction because otherwise. Oh, man, I'll sometimes, be lost like hell. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes, sometimes. sometimes. Uh, do, do the songs usually start off with Eugene playing, uh, playing something? Or it, it, can it yes. be in all sorts of. He, he writes the, the lyrics and the melodies and the ideas. Uh, and he has them first, and and, and and he comes to us in many different format, and uh, and it could be a jam session in the back lounge of the bus after a show, or it could be an actual rehearsal with an idea. Let's do something with this, and, and anything in between. Mm -hmm. And then from there, you can easily tell after a few times if this is a song that's going to make it into a certain place, and then and it grows like that naturally, and, mm -hmm. and eventually, if it's something that we all sort of like like and it stays as a song if not it comes and gets reincarnated in different forms and comes back again <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. and um, um was gypsy music often is is the, the 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 layer on which the other layers are built that right um not, not so often anymore no. like like i said earlier you know back in the days it was probably how it started mm -hmm. now it could be anything and, yeah. and, and so many different influences come come into a mm -hmm. to the whole.